Today we are here at the landings at Sage Glen by KB Homes. So there's two models here and we're actually in the southwest Las Vegas. So this is a cross of the Rainbow Crossings which I've done before so you guys can check it out. But today we're going to be looking at this model right here. Alright, so we're going to check out 1768. This looks like it's gonna go to the garage. It says garage. Upstairs. Wow, nice and open floor plan down here. Just at first glance. I like this. Oh. As you guys can see, the backyard, that looks really nice out there. But yeah, so I stumbled upon here, I was going to go to Cooper, Cooper Ranch, I think. And we're here at the Sage, I forgot what it's called. Oh, I thought you could go outside. It's nice though. Pretty okay size yard too. We definitely throw the pool in here. I think we're doing some work on, on this house, or maybe not, because that garage door system is going off, but I think they left already. So let's see. So the closet. Another closet here. And we have that. I think we can use it. I think this is one of those active ones in the model houses, but yeah. So as you guys can see how open this is. Heading into the kitchen, I do like this island. We got some options here for the tiles. It's nice. Then, let's see. Got a nice pantry in here. Upstairs before anybody comes. I think somebody's coming actually. Alright. Wow. Let me go to the corner and show you guys what I'm seeing. See so yourself a loft up here. Pretty big space. So here was the closet. Let's go this way actually. It's nice and cool in here too with the AC. So you got first bedroom here. It's a good size one too. Bigger than um I went to Richland Homes the other day, Richland American. And the bedrooms were not even as big as this. And this house doesn't even feel um, that big either. Or didn't even look like a big house from the outside. Got your closet there. This is facing the street, so. Yeah, they're working on these houses, or they're working on this house. I think they're in the garage. And then you got your bathroom here, so. It's 
That's all it sleeves right here though. And you can add in um, a double sink. See the one and two. Pretty cool. All right. So check this one out. This is a nice loft. And right here, sit down, relax. You can see everything from here too. the laundry room area. So this one doesn't have cabinets, but it does have a shelf. Pretty sure you can just install some cabinets here. And then the master. Damn. I like this one. Look at how huge this room is. And what I like about this room too is it's kind of away from the other bedrooms. So, you know, you get your privacy. Uh, everyone gets their privacy anyways. And, oh. Okay, so, out here into a master closet. Lots of space in here. Toilet, got your sinks and your shower. So definitely, I mean, for me, this is okay. Maybe somebody else, uh, eventually I probably wanna upgrade it. Upgrade my shower to something else. Maybe not the tub and shower, but. You got a closet here for all your towels. Cool. Nice, nice looking house. So that is gonna be it. Oh, one thing I do wanna talk about is these windows here. Cause there's only two windows in the corner. So you guys, I'm not sure if I like that, but. And this is gonna be facing outside. So let's see. So maybe if they had like a window right in the middle here, it would be fine, but yeah. So that is gonna be it for this house. Let's go check out the next one.